Welcome to the Bismarck State College video tutorial on how to understand your academic requirements report. This tutorial will explain the degree requirements for the Associate in Applied Science, AAS, degree and the diploma. The purpose of this tutorial is to demonstrate the use of key features in the interactive report. To verify the academic program, degree and catalog year are correct, view the information after the Notice section. The Collapse All and Expand All buttons lengthen and shorten your report. Collapsed requirements are the requirements that have been satisfied, and expanded requirements are the requirements that are not satisfied. These areas are also indicated with green directional arrows. An example of this is shown here. Areas that are collapsed look like this. Areas that are expanded look like this. Be sure to take note of what is already collapsed or expanded in your report. The course legend is found towards the top of the report, which indicates the status of a course. The green circle with a check mark indicates courses that have been taken. A yellow diamond indicates courses that you are currently enrolled in. And a blue star indicates courses you plan to take in the future. Here is an example. CIS 128, which is noted with a green circle, has been taken. The yellow diamond shows this student is currently enrolled in CIS 164. The college degree requirements are represented by the light blue colored bars. First is the minimum GPA requirements or grade point average. Students must have a minimum 2.0 GPA unless stricter requirements have been set by an individual program. There are three GPA requirements, the cumulative GPA, which includes BSc and transfer courses, institutional GPA, which is BSc courses only, the prescribed technical program GPA, which is made up of core courses designed by the program as prescribed or required. This requirement is shown under the Prescribed Technical Program Requirements section here. Expanding these sections will show courses used in calculating GPA as well as your actual GPA. The second requirement is minimum credits. The total credits requirement, which is made up of BSc, transfer, and alternative learning credits, requires a minimum of 60 total credits. Institutional credit must be taken at BSc. A minimum of 15 credits are required. Expanding these sections like this will show courses used to determine minimum credit requirements. The third requirement is general education. If earning an AAS degree, general education consists of requirements in Communications 1 and 2, Arts and Humanities, social and behavioral sciences, business, math, science and technology. A minimum of 15 credits is required with specific credit limits within each of the three general education areas. For a diploma, a minimum of nine general education credits are required within Communications 1, Arts and Humanities, social and behavioral sciences, business, math, science and technology. Some programs require specific general education courses. If this is the case, it will be displayed like this. This student is required to take CSCI 122 or CSCI 160 under Business, Math, Science, and Technology. If no specific general education courses are required, the requirement will look like this. The Arts and Humanities, Social and Behavioral Sciences requirement for this program allows students to choose courses from a course list. As you can see here, there are 103 options. It will also show the total credits required, total credits taken, and how many credits are still needed. Navigating through the course list in a particular requirement can be done by using the navigation links at the bottom by selecting View All, View 100, View 10, first and last links. The fourth requirement, prescribed technical, is made up of core courses required by the technical program. This requirement consists of more than half of the degree requirements. 
The courses required are displayed in the course list by semester or year. An example of this is shown here. Finally, some programs, after meeting general education and prescribed technical program areas, may also require program-specific electives and or free electives. If your program contains program electives, they will look like this. Remember to run your academic requirements report after you enroll in your courses in order to ensure that your requirements are satisfied. This concludes this presentation. To learn about other Campus Connection functions, review the comprehensive list under the Campus Connection tab on the BSC website.